explain why in just a second. Yesterday morning we hunted. Greasy. We got one one group to come in on an alfalfa field, like seven miles west of here, and we killed them, and there was just no birds flying. So we came here, came to the east to a field that we normally hunt late season because it's corn, and it happens to be an oat field that they cut. It's gonna be straw. Um, it was I don't know probably a hundred geese in it. <laughs> And I didn't think they were landing here with all this, all these piles, but they were piled in here, so it makes it easy for us to hide. So our plan is to hide into these rows and put some decoys out and give them the old bang when they show up in the morning. It's everywhere, dude. Oh yeah. Yeah, that's what we have a south southwest wind, not like real strong. be able to like manipulate how they land in here and last night we just seen a big group it was a big mass of them and then little little family groups kind of spread out throughout this whole thing so we're just going to try to mimic that we got a big mass here we'll put a few sleepers on the top of these rows like they were and then we'll put a big group here hopefully they're, com they're coming in from the north Fluff it up, fluff it up. Hey guys. You ready to go, Jaeger? You gonna go get some birds? <laughs> well, you said the word. one right here. Jaeger. Oh my god, dude, you blew. Hey, what up, click? Yeah, I did go click. Good boy! Can you do a quick sweep and make sure there isn't another one hidden somewhere? I mean, we can while well, there's nothing in the air. Huh? Well, I feel like we did too, but I just want to make sure. Like, there's not like another in a row or something. Here they come, guys. Oh Here they come. Go ahead, kill one. talk to this lady see if we can resolve this kind of doubting it but but what she's doing is hunter harassment so let's see what happens well right now she's playing games get out here to the road talk to her she takes off but it's on video and law enforcement's been called so it is what it is uh, I guess I'll leave them back at the blinds. I'm going to come out here and uh, talk to law enforcement and uh, hopefully talk to her. So anyway, see what happens.
So uh, hopefully law enforcement shows up rather quick. The guys are still out in the field. She's real. Oh, there she goes again. What she does. What she doesn't realize is that she's only pushing the geese more out in front of the guys. So she's an absolute idiot. She's going to get a ticket for this. It's kind of funny. Not really. I'm a little pissed off. I can't be out there, but hey, we're a team. They're still getting birds. And, uh, we're just going to have to deal with this until law enforcement shows up. We've got some more birds working their way in back there. And here she goes again. Now that vehicle coming out. Take them, boys. <laughs> Show this, Karen. How you doing, officer? Good. What's my name? Chad Sprint. Chad, we got this lady here. Um, she lives right here. Okay. And we're goose hunting. We turkey hunt across the road. We got permission on both these fields. We've hunted them for years. Okay. Um, every time we try to come out hunting, she drives out in the field over here, honks the horn. Okay. Right now, she's doing the same thing. I got it all on video. Okay. Um, so I got a lot of footage she of it. She doesn't have permission or access to either one of these people. No, she does not. Okay. And the guy that owns it's talked to her. We've tried to talk to her and be cordial about it. And okay. it's just, we can't get nowhere with it. Okay. Um, I think we just got our limit of birds, so we'll be out of here now. <laughs> but, maybe get her some, some goose jerky, maybe that'll Yeah, it will not with this lady. No. We've tried everything. I, I'm recording, by the way. Is that all right? But, um, yeah, so I don't... I don't, we don't know what to do. Maybe yeah. you guys talk to her. Um, we'd actually like to have her ticketed for hunter harassment at this time. Because this costs, you know, it's expensive to come out and do this. I yeah. So. I'm good. Can get your name real quick, buddy? Yep. Casey. S-T-E-R-T. -E -R -T? E -R -T or D? Uh, is S-T-E-R-T. -E yep. What's your middle name, Casey? Uh, w. Wayne. Data bar. 10 5 Phone number, please. 231 yep. 920 Yep. Okay, you said it's been going on for a few years? Uh, Last year and this year for sure, yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So, I mean, we're certainly going to ask the CO to give her a ticket for hunter harassment, you know, yeah, because it's not going right to. Oh, really? So. Yeah, because this is ridiculous. You know, it's expensive to come out and do this, you know, and time getting up in the morning and just to get, you know, and the funny thing is, I'll be honest with you, when she honks the horn, then birds loop around in front of them, but <laughs> <laughs> it's just more annoyance than anything, but, you know. Okay, I'll talk to her. All right, I appreciate All right. it. Thank you. I'm going to go help them guys get the birds out. <laughs> you take care of this fucking nut job? Not yet. <laughs> Not yet Good morning. Good morning. I'm Spencer. Hey, did Spencer. you see that last? Yeah. We just needed yeah, one, you. and he cleaned out that one shot was beautiful. Heck, we were about ready to start shooting from here. I'm like, <laughs> what are you waiting on? <laughs> uh, DNR's in route, so I'm just going to turn this over to him. Let him All right. Deal with it, so. I say we see if we can get it's the just, CO to give her a ticket. It's stop, man. Yeah. Turkey yep. season shoot. I talked to her sister. She's like, I'm so sorry. I'll handle it with my with Mary. 
nothing happened. Here she is again. But I heard she's kind of a nut job. Like she's a little bit First lost. time I've ever met her. She freaking played games with me turkey season. Well, we've been, no, God, we've been nothing but nice to her, you know? We're not doing anything illegal, man. We're 100% legit. But the DNR piped in, they said they're on their way, so I'm gonna let them deal with it. I don't know if he's gonna come with me. No, he ain't gonna move. But it was pretty locked down. You bleeding? No, it's goose. Oh. <laughs> well, what's funny is when she was honking her horn, though, those ge geese kind of pushed back a little bit further right in front of you guys. Locked up coming in, she started honking, and they kind of flared away. I'm like, God damn it. And then they came in anyway. <laughs> That's funny. That's just ridiculous, man. We're not do we're not fuck with anybody. I'll tell you what though. The blind setup looks money with all the others stacked on more. Hey everywhere. Yeah. Good. Right, sir. Sure got all my clothes on right. <laughs> <laughs> I did. I did. Sorry. Went to, went to bed last night. Ostrich, my name, by the way. No asking. So I'm, these, these I'm, guys are hunting out here. This lady lives there. She is known for parking on the road and honking when the geese are coming in. Um, she told me there wasn't any laws that prevented her, and I corrected her and said there was. And, uh, she straight up admitted everything to me, and these guys got it on video. She uh she also when we turkey hunt across and by the way do you mind if I record or not? I know, I'd rather I mean you can but I don't want you to record man. You know. <laughs> I'll, I'll shut it off. How about that? I'll explain why in just a second. Yeah, that's an old picture, not a gray hair in it. <laughs> <laughs> is it is because each hunter is an individual instance of hunter so harassment. when i do so here's the way it's going to work and i'm sorry wait can you can you just like explain the law to us and i'll shut this off all right just all right so hunter harassment in order to for it to be a hunter harassment complaint or case everybody needs to be 100 percent legal so let's say let's say i came out and checked you and you had lead today okay well these guys because there's more there's three there's four of you and the three of you are legal well i still have a hunter harassment case but it wouldn't be against you oh so okay. where it would come into play is let's say you're bow hunting or you're deer hunting i explained to her i said you could literally put a deer blind right here to hunt out of right and i said and that's legal so let's go down to one person's hunting and let's say you're hunting right here okay and i come up and check you and you have something that's wrong you didn't you didn't have the right license to hunt that day or whatever Hunter harassment is no longer It just it. voids it, huh? It voids it. I got you. All right, guys. Well, one of the officers didn't want to be recorded the whole time he was talking, and out of respect for him, I chose not to. And that's okay. Um, the way it all went down was we were 100% legal, and she was 100% outside the law. Uh, it was deemed hunter harassment. Uh, the local conservation officer and sheriff explained that to her very well. And they have since turned the uh, case over to the prosecutor. Uh, we've tried, we, like, I, like you see in the video, we tried to work with this lady for three years now and uh, couldn't get anywhere, obviously. So I had to go this route, which is very unfortunate. But uh, yeah, that being said, get out there, enjoy the outdoors. And knock them down, boys. See you next time.